Hey guys, we just got out of the Sydney premiere of Bohemian Rhapsody. Mamma mia, mamma mia. Oh, mamma mia, let me go. So guys, before we go on, don't forget, hit the subscribe button. The bell button, right there. Very important bell button. Share this with your friends because we're about to chat about a brand new film directed oh, by yes. Brian Singer called Bohemian Rhapsody. So this is a story about Queen. John, Brian, Roger, and of course, the iconic, the legendary Freddie Mercury. It shows the beginnings of Queen. This is not really a biopic of Freddie, so to speak. It's about the entire group. Yeah. It shows the love interest between Mary, his love of his life. Yes. He wrote a song for it that was beautiful. It shows his turbulent relationship between Paul. You could tell he was a bit of a... Well, we, you know the story if you know about Freddie Mercury. And then it shows sort of a little bit of his love at the end with John. Yeah, yeah. But this was just incredible. Like, goosebumps, tears, emotions. This is everything you can expect from a biopic about one of the greatest bands ever lived. Yeah, it was an amazingly directed film. Uh, amazingly written. I was oh, yeah. trying to keep notes and I'm like, there's so many things <laughs> happening. Like, there was like 17 different things happened within a course of like seven minutes and i looked at my watch and oh, i was yeah. like wow the only seven minutes have gone past it's, it's an insanely directed oh it's so so so, super, so super. well done tell me what you were saying about like i was looking at you throughout the film yeah and we're looking at remy malik as freddie well are you sure because i'm pretty confident that freddie mercury himself oh, embodied remy malik so well that it's not Rami Malek playing Freddie Mercury, but Freddie somehow came back to life. Rami Malek's insane. performance is without a doubt Oscar worthy. Ding, and ding, he's ding, gonna win Oscar. so many awards, it's not even funny. Beautifully directed, beautifully filmed, oh, yeah, beautifully definitely. cut, just it, it was an amazing film, but yeah, can't get past that oh performance by Rami Malek. It was such a beautiful uh, love story between also Mary and Freddie. I think that was one of the big like impacted the whole film yeah you got to see that unfold and then you got to see a lot of uh freddie trying to discover himself try to discover yeah. his sexuality who he is as a person yeah. and i'm glad they didn't you know negatively portray him the best thing about the love story in this film mm. is that it wasn't cliche this no. was a a person a man who was deeply yeah in love with humanity he, it didn't matter if he was gay, bi, straight. He was oh. just a lover of people. He had an incredible love with Mary. Mary, yeah, it was, as he it was, was beautiful. His, his love of his life, he wanted to marry her. He, there was no falseness behind that love no, story. It's, it's also crazy when you're watching it because you know, you've seen the documentaries, you've seen all the biopics, you read the books about Freddie's life, but to see it portrayed on film, it's just incredible. I want to touch on Remy Malik again because you know we said that how much he looks like him but he embodied every performance if you watch the live yeah. eight performance oh. and you match up both of them it's uncanny the way he sings like his facial expressions like you know that he's not actually singing like with freddie's voice in it like they did have a freddie impersonator who sort of did some of the other vocals sure. that weren't actually recorded you know by freddie himself and then they used all freddie's performances and i think uh rami maybe sung a little bit but it was more so lip syncing throughout the film, sure. which he did freaking perfectly. Those teeth, outstanding. Yeah. The crazy thing that I want to like just get through to you guys, you know, we witnessed someone transforming into a character and becoming person. him. Like not a person. Even, no, not was, even a character. Sorry yeah, about that. Yeah. He transformed into Freddy. He was Freddy. The yeah. voice, the actions, everything, even the look. Like, I can't get over that. Oh, and a bit of a cameo from Mike Myers. He Beautifully. Was, Outstanding. We won't give too much away, but that was just flawless. What more can I say, guys? This is one of the best biopics ever created. We're saying Oscar. Oscar wins. Wins. Lots Oscar of wins. wins. So many wins. For the film, for Remy Malik, for the supporting cast, it was absolutely phenomenal. I know I probably coined the phrase a lot, movie of the year. Yeah. I would say for me, A Star Is Born and Bohemian Rhapsody definitely tie it. Great. Like, just phenomenal. I can't speak more highly of this movie. If you get a chance, go see it because we highly recommend it. Highly. And you will not be disappointed. You will not. This is definitely an amazing film. 
make sure you catch it in the cinema because it's mm. definitely so good on the big screen. Sounds amazing, looks amazing, worth Flawless. every penny. Flawless. So anyway, guys, I'm Justin. I'm Draz. And we will see you nerds at, at the, the movies. movies. <laughs>